Once again, ladies and gentlemen, 20 minutes duration and one fall, one submission. Or a knockout decides the winner. In the red corner, wrestler known as the monarch of the Glen, Wild Angus. On my left, in the blue corner from Birmingham, Pat Roach. So here we go for the second eliminator for this uh, super heavyweight tournament. Knockout tournament, of course, and already we've seen giant haystacks of all people disqualified and Ray Steele getting to the final. Now, one of these two men is going into the final later this afternoon against Ray Steele. Which one will it be? Pat Roach on the right, Pat Roach from Birmingham, and Wild Angus, there he is. Wild Angus from, now from Manchester, but formerly from Scotland, of course. Both men are around the 19 and a half stone. Nothing much in it weight-wise. Pat Roach, perhaps the taller. Seconds away, time. And slightly the heavier. 20 minutes of wrestling, no rounds. The first fall or submission or knockout is the decider who goes into the final against Ray Steele. Right over the top there in that arm lock. There it is against the jaw. No, no, no. Over the top, but not right over. Grabs the head scissors. Roach really wanted to get right over them, get out of the unlock. Oh, monkey climbing with Angus. Nineteen and a half stone going over there. Side headlock, Roach. <laughs> Referee Dave Reese uh, looked after the last one. This time it's Jeff Kay on this eliminator. And warning Angus. That strap up here yeah, from a leotard. That's all he wants. For Nelson Angus. Trying to get Angus all the way over. with a one arm, then gets the arm lock now, Roach, in his turn. He's got him back to canvas finally, really properly. The only thing he can hold him there, shaking his head, Roach, there, is to say, I'll never hold that. Goes for the double finger in the lock instead. So the strain on his face as he 
tries to haul him over from that. Roach goes right the way down that bridge, but comes up again. Angus doesn't go down that bridge, he goes flat back to canvas is where Roach wants it. But he tried this before, he can't hold it there. Full Japanese triangle hold instead. on the ropes three times four right in front of the referee what else can Jeff Kay do but deliver a public call the first public warning goes to Wild Angus first public warning <laughs> so we're a quarter of the way through this uh, eliminator five minutes gone And that Leotard's trap is down again. The referee won't like that because of the tricks that Wild and Angus gets up to. First public warning goes to Pat Roach. First public warning to Pat Roach. Attacking on the ropes when told not to. So one public warning each. Side of the forearm being up by both men. There's another. Caught him nicely, knee drop by Roach. Beauty. Referee didn't spot it, but Loach felt it all right, and we all saw it from this side of the ring. And I'm sure the cameras saw it very clearly too. one more I think it's a second public warning to him only just waited he was up there and that looked very like another punch and he referee spotted that one the second and final public warning goes to wild Angus and so Angus is, hasn't got any left Pat Roach has got one left if he needs to but I'm sure he doesn't need to That was a slap rather than a punch, that second one, but I'm not sure about the one in the corner post. Roach try a cross ballot from the man. Ah, ah, ah. Ah. <laughs> well, Roach felt it again, so he knows it was a punch, but Angus trying to pretend to everybody that it was a forearm. Lovely backdrop, caught him well, follow up to cross press, two, three, he's got him. 
So Pat Roach goes through to the final in eight minutes, 50 seconds of this 20 minute contest and goes into the final against Ray Steele. In three minutes, 50 seconds, the winning fall goes to Pat Roach. And ladies and gentlemen, may I make a correction to the time of the fall, eight minutes, 50 seconds. And your appreciation for the loser, Wild Angus. Right. All right, look. Win. You want a bet high stacks, bet high stacks. Pat, we'd love to do that. We can't. We've got a program to do. And you must remember you're in the grand final. And if it's all right with you, you can have a 40 second break or just stay here and we'll get the wrestler into the ring who you've got to meet in the final. You want to continue? Fair enough. <laughs>